Hey, welcome everybody. I'm a rough pebble and today we're going to be diving into Odd Realm. Really excited to be checking out this game and playing it for the channel. Uh, it just released the beta branch uh, for the Timeless Tyrants update and I'm very excited to be checking it out. There's a lot of cool new features and let's just go ahead and dive in. This game is um, very much uh, reminiscent of Dwarf Fortress, and RimWorld and other games, but it has a lot of its own elements that it brings to the table and I'm so excited to be diving in. As I mentioned, it's an early access game, so you can still see there's some content that is being developed and worked on, um, and and that's a good thing in my opinion. Uh, just watching this game grow has is, is been fun. Um, in terms of world size, I'm going to be just maxing everything out here, and we'll just roll the seed to be something like uh, 48675, perfect. And we'll rename the realm to... Uh, let's go with, like, Gimel, no. We were. Eh. They were. Vakil. Nathan. No, Vavil. We'll go with Vavil. It seems good. Now we get to choose a landing spot for our colonists. I'm gonna pause the time here, otherwise it's just gonna continue to tick. Um, I'm not particularly thrilled with this map. Let's just go ahead and do roll a new map here. We can just do that a couple times. Until we get something maybe that's more interesting. It's kind of interesting. Hmm, I don't like all these just individual islands. I would rather have untamed depths. Interesting. Maybe like a longer land mass. Maybe just one or two large land masses. That's not bad. That's a little bit better. Um, not exact. There's too much. This seems interesting. There's a lot of population around down here. Um, you know what? I'm going to keep rolling a few more times here. Eh, too small, too much water. Hmm. Also not exactly what I'm looking for. This is better. Yes. Okay. Um, let's look for a landing spot here. So definitely dogs and sheep would be nice. Um, let's see if we can maybe find something with cows. Yeah, there's a place with cows. It'll take a little bit of time to find a good spot. We also want to keep an eye on um, sort of what the terrain looks like here. Bugs, owls, sheep. What about over here? Chicken chirping. Owls, deer, nightwing. Chicken, cows, cats. Chicken, cows, and cats. Just sheep. Dogs, owls, rats, newts. Hmm. More mountain. These mountains don't really have a ton of really great animals in them. There's a little bit more here. Not much, but a little bit. Cows, dogs, snoots. Not sure what a snoot is. It's chicken night wings. Or what about over here? Yeah, so this seems actually pretty interesting. Mountain Taiga River.
Let's go with this place. This place seems cool. It's a little chilly, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and settle here. Now we get to choose an option between Pioneers, which is easy, a Band of Fighters, which would be medium, and a hard lone settler leaving off, living off the land. I think we're going to try with the, the Hermit here and see how far we can make it. Uh, Pebbleton. And uh, let's go ahead and dive in with our one settler. So this is going to be a pretty challenging uh, run, I think. We'll hopefully be able to survive with just the one. Uh, there weren't too many um, dangerous animals here, so let's go ahead and pause. I'm going to scroll up just so I can see uh, what all we're working with here. There are a lot of mountains up here. Uh, we can see the elevation that we're at when we're um, scrolling up and down here. So as we get closer to the water, some of these things, these mountains... Uh, we're just looking at cross-sections of them. Very much like Dwarf Fortress. Um, which is exciting. So I, I'm actually very interested to see what what we have down here. It looks like maybe there's a little cavern over here. And then just water in the river. Um, okay. And then the depths. Um... This is this is great. I'm I'm liking this map a lot. I'm I'm curious where we might find food. There's some beets and some blackberries right there already, so that's really good. Um I think I kind of want to build into this mountain here. So we can maybe cut down all of this, terraform it, and then um, have maybe like a few workshops and things down here. I think that could be good. And then start building stuff inside the mountain. A mountain fortress. Okay. This is good. Um, let's start... Okay, yeah, let's just start over here. This is good. I'll just do it right here. Yes, confirm. All right, so there we are. Um, our lone survivor. Cavern Sander. Good man. Let's take a look at you. You are not particularly skilled in mining, logging, carpentry, masonry, but you're very good at cloth working, leather working, alchemy, interested in writing, cooking, horticulture. You're just going to do all of these things for right now. You can do a little bit of fighting, not so good at range, decent at animal husbandry. We're just going to have you do everything right now because you're the only person here. I'm also going to set quickly a stockpile around this. Oh, whoops, we need to go down to here and set a stockpile here. Okay, good. Um, and then I want to chop down a few trees. Come over here and chop down these. Alright, let's go for that. We need wood. We have to climb up and down each one of these uh, bits of elevation, so the less we have to do, the better. But you're coming over here to chop this one down. Yeah, it's taking all day just to just to get out there. Okay, we have food and water here. 
Um, let's also put it in order to go collect a little bit of water. Just do a little bit there. Get us started. And then to harvest. Um... I want to go harvest this food. What is this? Large crab grass. You want to go for the beets? What else? Anything else out here that's that's worth grabbing? Uh, some more blackberries and beets bunch of food okay so that'll get us started on farming we definitely want to get some fields going or some crops going here i think i want to go with horticulture and get some beetroots planted here And some blackberries planted here. I want to chop down these two trees. Oh, and there's a blackberry bush here as well. Okay. Yes, plant. Plant our crops. Alright, so I think I want to speed this up even further. Since we're just alone out here. Okay. We have plenty of food, plenty of water, plenty of things to do. Okay, we've got plant fiber here and... Beetroot seeds are underneath it, I believe. Okay. The other thing we want to do is start thinking about where we're going to build our workshop. Let's do a... Let's do something like... Two, three, six. Yeah, let's just do something like that. Oh, oh, oh. You know what? I, I know exactly what the issue is. I'm building on the wrong elevation. I need to be building down here. Yes. Um, okay. Something like that. And this will be our workshop. <clears throat> okay, perfect, perfect. And there's fish. Allied wall. There's a fish in there. Which is maybe a good thing. We're not seeing fish anywhere else, which is... That's not particularly a great thing. It's not the end of the world, but... There's plenty of fishing here. Okay. And you've nearly built this house. 
Let's go ahead and set up the uh, thatch roof. Here. Home of industry written. Okay. Um, you know what? Let's actually pull back. Whoops. Go to the thatch roof here. Don't put that up. We have a Tome of Industry. We can invest that Tome of Industry into woodworking, understanding wood a little bit better. And then that, from there, can lead us into, let's see, build menu. Close this inventory bat tab. Room menu. I want to build a wood mill here. Wood mill requires a workbench. So we'll go into the props, grab a workbench, put it here. All right, we're planting some more seeds. All right, we've built the workbench into the wood mill. We can now assign jobs. All of this would be good. Um, let's actually make one of these and a hammer. Some spoons. Make one of everything. Just make it all. Okay. Got wood planks. Matter of fact, let's put the floor in first. Uh, up again. I'm in the wrong level. We need to be on the first floor here. There we go. Yep, there you go. Put in a door. Sleep on ground, okay. We'll get you a bed here in just a little bit. Okay. Game is saved. Um, in terms of... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. In terms of the wood planks, we're trying to work on the, all of these other things first. Do you have anything equipped currently? No. Yes, you're just making all these tools here. Okay, there we go. Okay, perfect. Keep working on the floor here. And we want to put in a roof, wood shingle roof here. Okay. Do we need more wood? Yeah, we have plenty of wood. Still have plenty of food, plenty of water. Chickens have appeared. Well, I would love to go ahead and get some of those. For now, let's put in um, a home here. Home here. And kitchen here. And then build a bed. And we need a fire here. Tome of Industry written. Fantastic. 
We're gonna hold on to that for now, though. We've got too much work to do as it is. Okay, keep building the roof. Build these beds. Fantastic. We're definitely missing a little bit of wood. I think we could use, well, it would just be nice if we could just bring it in, right? But we're not doing that currently. Okay, and there's an elder plant bush there. Alright, we've got two beds here, which is great. We've got all these tools out here. Uh-oh. Indris. Wedjequin. You. We finally caught up with you. We've still got lots of food to spare, too. Do you have room for us? Oh, sure. Yeah, plenty of room. Okay, good. Let's get to work. Alright. We have friends. We have friends. Okay. Well, we only have two beds currently down. But that's okay. Um, let's take a look at who else we have here. Let's look at skill permissions. Um, in terms of mining, everybody else is better than you. So you don't need to do this. Um, logging skill, we're going to give it to these three. I'd like to assign three folks to each job, if possible. Carpentry skill, masonry. Three there. Those three. That's fine. I mean, if more people are doing it, that's fine, too. You don't need to do this. You also, don't, you don't need to do the fishing here. I mean, that's fine. You don't need to do that. Removing skill. All right, we're going to put you on that. You don't need to summon. You all should learn to fight, though. Can I plant trees? No. Ah, uh, I see. Um, we're trying to put blackberry plants up here. That's not how you do this. Um, we can put blackberries here. And the beets we can grow right here. And then we need to go find more seeds, because I messed that up. There we go. More blackberries here. Surely there will be more beets as well. There we go. There's a beet right there. Yeah, right there. Yeah, folks just sort of wandering around everywhere. Let's chop down a few of these trees here. Yeah, chop them down here. Okay, and then let's speed things up just a touch chopping. We're getting wood out of it. Great. 
Okay, there we go. And then for food production, let's go to the kitchen, add a job. Do one till five, sure. Or do one till 10. 10 seems better actually. Another wood mill. The wood planks do until 40 here. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's slow down. And what do we... Who's our best miner? Let's go ahead and assign a role. Stone Mason, Shepherd, Blacksmith, Alchemist. You're just a laborer. Tavern, you are not the person to go mining. Blacksmith. Okay, we're gonna change your profession to a miner for right now. Actually, you can just keep your profession. Honestly, that's fine. You are going to be a... Well, we don't really need that right now. Um... Let's see, I want to... Is that all overlays? No. Let's just mine into... Okay, and we're digging in. stone chunks being mined away. Um, and well, you know what? You know what we can do then? Go into the individuals. Let's see, you are... Go into your inventory here. And we can just give you a pickaxe. Just to you, not the blacksmiths, yeah. Perfect. Okay, you're just gonna be a lot better at Take mine mining now. Okay. stone chunks in here right now. Gonna have to do something about this. Um, and then do I want... Okay, wait, can I look at... Halite wall. 
Fable of Sandstone. <clears throat> we go into Saga Overview. Car stone carved wall, stone brick wall. Okay, this is actually what I'm interested in. We need more tomes, though. Alright. Um... Let's put a room in here. We'll do a home here. So I'll we'll just be home for now. Build a few more beds in here. Just do something like that. Put a bunch of beds in here. I think we want wood plank floors in here. And I think we're gonna toss in a couple doors as well. Wood door. We need some coal. Where is all the coal? There's a little bit right here, actually. Some up the top of this mountain. Jobs and tasks. And potatoes. Why are we storing the potatoes in here? Okay. Well, I think things are moving along very, very nicely here. We've got our workshop. Um, we're expanding into the mountain here. Uh, need a little bit of coal just so that we can light up uh, the depths of the mountain. It's not so dark in here. Uh, and then we're going to just sort of try to make this place a little bit more comfy. But without, uh, without uh, a little bit more technology, we're going to struggle to do that. So we're just, we just need to sit and be patient with that. Thanks for watching, everybody. Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you haven't yet, make sure to hit subscribe, and we'll catch up in the next episode. Take care. Bye.